Good morning, DC. This is Cassidy Burns with BPG Residential. And this week we're gonna be discussing everything that's going on in the Washington, DC, Northern Virginia real estate market, February 7th through February 13th. Let's get into it. Interest rates did have a slight increase last week. They are now at 7.16% interest. In the DC condo space, 92 units were listed, 61 went under contract, 26 sold, the average days on market being 48. The average purchase price, $548,273, selling at 100% of list. So if you listed a property for $500,000, you were selling that property for $500,000 on average. In the single family space in Washington, DC, there were 95 houses listed, 69 went under contract, 45 sold, the average days on market being 44. The average purchase price, $1,044,738, selling at 98.7% of list, meaning that in the single family space, you could have gotten a slight discount. And my favorite asset class in Washington, DC, DC small multifamily, seven houses were listed, six went under contract, two were sold, the average days on market being 36, the average purchase price pretty low for the for the DC area, 687,500. Remember that's only based on the two that sold last week, selling at 99.1% of list. So, now let's go to Northern Virginia. In Northern Virginia, the condo space, 59 units were listed, 65 went under contract, 52 were sold, the average days on market being 26, the average purchase price of a Northern Virginia condo is $420,300, selling at 103, 100.3% of list. In the Northern Virginia single family space, 86 houses were listed, 103 went under contract, 58 were sold, the average days on market being 22, the average purchase price, 1,036,000, selling at 101.5% of list. So if you're bidding on single family houses, and this also includes townhomes in the Northern Virginia area last week, you paid a little bit above asking price. It is February 14th today as I, as I record this, and you, if you are in the market right now, you've probably heard that yes, multiple offers are back, mostly because of the interest rate drop. Now I know last week we had a slight increase, but there are more buyers that can now afford those assets. So if you're a buyer right now, be prepared to compete. Thanks again. We do this every single week. This is Cassidy Burns with BPG Residential. Talk soon.